arrest warrant for the owner of a local roofing company after multiple clients say he took their money, never did the work. We're talking about felony charges here, accused of ripping off the most vulnerable. News 5's Maggie Bryan spoke with a victim and a former contractor who says the business owes his family more than $9,000. Aspen Roofing and Exteriors used to operate out of this business space here on North Academy Boulevard, but now all that is left is a note from the sheriff's office after a deputy tried serving the business legal papers. Now police say the co-owner is facing multiple felonies and a warrant is out for his arrest after alleged theft from multiple clients. David Wolfram says last July he started a new job as a sales contractor with Aspen Roofing and Exteriors. I was very excited because I'd been looking for a job for months. He says his father was his first client. I said I'm going to see this through from start to finish. That's what a good contractor does. Wolfram says during the two months he worked for the company, he never did see a project completed. After three weeks, my customers were calling me. He says the work on his clients' roofs, including his father's, never started. And a warrant is now out for the arrest of the company's co-owner, Todd Halliburka. Court documents show Halliburka is facing two felony charges for crimes against at-risk persons, listing Wolfram's mother and father as two of the three victims. The documents also reveal a bank account in the business's name had a balance of one penny at the end of November last year. The document shows between August and November last year, only two transactions were made at a home improvement store and says the rest of the money was spent at restaurants, grocery stores, hair salons, coffee houses, a bar, and more. The Secretary of State's office says the roofing company voluntarily closed its doors on March 7th, but the Wolfram family is still fighting for their money back. We're still chasing them down today. And now without their father, who passed suddenly last September. That left my mom as a widow, and we were still trying to make touch base with them. When Wolfram's sister Dawn says their mother is now dealing with the stress of lost money and a roof still needing to be fixed. She's just been really heartbroken over it and just can't believe anybody would do this to her. We just want the money back to my family. I want it back to my other customers so that there's no harm, no foul. We'll just walk away. David and his family say they still hope to settle everything outside of court to get their money back. If you think you are a victim of Aspen Roofing and Exteriors, you can call Colorado Springs Police. That's at 719-444-7000. In Colorado Springs, I'm Maggie Bryan, News 5.